how to adjust map zoom settings. This is a Garmin Nuvi 2597 LMT, however, these instructions will also work for pretty much any Nuvi drive or drive smart model made after 2013, which includes 2457, 2497, 2557, 2597, 2797, Nuvi, 5556, 57, 58, 65, 66, 67, 68, 27, 98, 25, 59, 25, 99, 26, 59, 26, 99, 27, 89, drive, drive 5, drive 50, 60, drive smart 50, 60, 70, Drive Assist 5051, Drive Lux 5051, Drive 5161, Drive Smart. Sorry, I have to go through all the models so you guys know. I'll get to it in just a second. Uh, let's see Drive Smart 51, Drive Assist 51, Drive Lux 51, Drive Smart 61, 65, Drive Smart 55, Drive 52. Don't know, didn't try it. The new ones, Drive Smart 66, 76, 86, don't know. Haven't tried it. Right. Now there is the basic and then there's the advanced way. So, basic way first. Settings, map and vehicle, auto zoom, enabled or disabled. That is the basic way. This is the advanced way. The reason I'm making this video is someone commented on it. I said, oh, this would make a good video. So anyway, from here, volume, and then press and hold the top right corner of the screen until you get to the diagnostics page. Scroll down, developer tests and tools. This is under display. Uh, nope, map drawing, and then auto zoom. All right, what do we got here? Well, first of all, if you screw up here, you can always click the little hamburger menu and do reset default zoom. So if I change this one, for example, and it's been changed, and I don't remember what the default setting is, I can just do this, and it resets it. Right. Now, this one is configured for miles, so all these figures over here meaning 0.2 mile, 0.8 mile, 0.2 mile, 0.2 mile, and so on. If it were in kilometers, it would show it in a kilometer view. Now, the one that is highlighted in red, it is assumed right now that it is driving local. And what that means is pretty much in a stopped state. That's why it's red. It doesn't mean it's wrong, it doesn't mean it's modified, it just means that's the one I'm looking at right now. That's what the GPS is thinking. If you are simulating a route, or just driving around, then you should not. Please don't. Don't adjust this while driving around. Do it while stopped, stationary, in the house, whatever. If you were on the highway, for example, the high, highway one would be highlighted in red, or if you were on a ramp, exit or entrance ramp, etc. So there's, you'll notice there's driving and there's routing. So during driving, depending on what type of road you're on, it's the one that's highlighted. If you're routing, same thing, meaning the difference between a, it telling you directions, which would be routing, and when it's not telling you directions, you're driving. So what we have here is just six options, well seven, with the auto zoom enabled, which is the same thing as the regular menu I showed you a moment ago. As in how much will the map zoom into when it encounters one of these roads? Now I'll just concentrate on the routing one since that's probably the one that you're interested in. Local means not highway, not ramp. Okay, and right now it is set to a 0.2 mile zoom by default. Okay, so if I change that, I can either change it to an increased number, which means further away, or a decreased number, which means, um, this is in feet, by the way. If it was in kilometers, this would be meters. 
so by default it's going to zoom the map to a 0.2 mile distance if I don't want that if I want it nice and tight I would do a 500 foot if I want it further away I could set it to a half a mile for example if I wanted to and then I just change the other ones to follow suit and that's pretty much it it will save the setting as far as I know and again you can go here and do the res reset default zoom and once you're done with this it's automatically saved you just back 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 and it the setting should take at that point so again just to recap to get to that advanced setting volume press and hold the top right of the screen and wait developer tests and tools map drawing auto zoom make your settings actually I'll show you a quicker way to get out of here just press and hold the back button there we go and off you go